their majesties would call before them an Alita Falconbridge to answer the question posed before her. Good afternoon. Anna Alita, it is so nice to see you on such a, what I assume is warm and sunny day. It was a dark night in a tent the last time we spoke where we asked you a very pertinent question. We would like to hear the answer to that. I uh, would be honored to join this esteemed order and my answer is yes. Excellent. Uh, Audrey, would you invite the order to join us? Their majesties call before them their companions to the order of the pelican. As they flock to us, um, I would love to hear some words about this candidate. Is there a member of the Order of the Pelican that would speak? Your Imperial Majesties, I, Eldredi de Tamworth, would claim that right. Gracious Consuls, Your Excellencies, and the word, gentle friends, and people of the East. When we speak of service, we often speak of single individuals, people laboring, solitary, behind a curtain, creating and maintaining the structure that we all inhabit. To wit, we speak of Quiet. <laughs> I would venture to say that of all of the many people who have met this extraordinary woman, not very many of them would say, ah yes, quiet. <laughs> and indeed, when your noble ancestors raised her to the laurelet, we all thought, of how often we find her singing. And I would put it to you that between those two truths is the truth and essence of the service of Anne Lady Falconbridge. Because when she serves, she sings. And people hear that and they say, what is happening? I will go <laughs> and see. And when they come to her, she welcomes them with open hands and open arms and says, come sing with me, serve with me, and find the joy that is there. And in serving loudly and openly and inclusively, she serves this kingdom, she serves your people, she serves our society, and she makes all of our service greater and greater music when she does. Your Imperial Majesty, this is a good and right thing that you do today. Thank you. Those were some really lovely words. I, I am I am most humbled by those and really, really like to thank the order for being able for us to do this today. I hear there are some mittens of maintenance. <laughs> there are your majesty. These were made for Mistress. Annalita by our sister, our apprentice sister, oh, Hrethna. They are now bended with love and with care. Those are for you. Oh, I love them. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, they're so nice. <laughs> oh, they're so mean. They're so You don't have to keep them on, but mm -hmm. within your hands so she can see. <laughs> <laughs>
Those are fantastic. Those will serve you well in the in the cold nights. Uh, her hands well maintained. Is there a medallion that may adorn? There is, there is your majesty's. This is a, um, a family heirloom. <laughs> Starting from uh, Tanis of Tiradon, Tanek of Anacester, Kara Marie of Carlisle, Oriana of Zylina, Lucy Lovegood of Ramsgate, Alana Urquhart, Sylvia Duvet, Cedric of Thanet, and myself, Otto Gottlieb. Your Majesties, I also have a, a medallion for Miss Vithanaleda. It comes from Solera. Oh. And she wanted to get this to you. Well, I want you to see it. It is gold. It is glass. Oh, it has oh, been yeah, embossed lovely. with gold with beads mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. I am sure have been made by Solera. Yes. <laughs> who I know you know very well. Yes. I hope it goes over your head. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. And, and lastly, is there a coat? There is your majesty's. So this is Mistress Annalita's laurel cloak that I made for her, her coat. And I got to add to it for her. So. Oh. Can you see? Oh, oh my goodness. There are, um. Oh, there. lovely. <laughs> That's great. Thank you, they're so yeah. perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my gosh. Anyway. Fully <laughs> 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 adorned and supported with words, we would hear your voice and have your oath. Your Majesties, um, I will give you my oath in one moment. I may beg just a moment to provide a, a word before of thanks and gratitude for this day, which comes, of course, um, Mr. Strata said that it brings a lot of people and a lot of people have come today and a lot of people have made sure that this day and all of the things that led to it could happen. My husband, Andre Kibotule, has um, tended home and hearth for many, many years so that I could do the things that I do. And I could not do them. Our son, Jesse, has uh, allowed a lot of time for his mother to go and do things while he might have wanted her to do other things or been coming to events. Um, and they have both been so incredibly supportive and marvelous. My beloved households and my barony have made sure that there is always somebody else to help with the work and the joy of that work because it is, as Mr. Strata said, never accomplished alone. And I wanted to express uh, to you and to all of my beloveds how very grateful I am and thankful for all of the things that you do. So. Thank you. That's what I have to say about that. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you for sharing that with us. We know full well the team it takes to accomplish anything. Uh, and in all honesty, I'm so happy to see so many people gathered with you today. Um, but also, it's fantastic to have all of you, everyone who's there, all of you on the East Kingdom team uh, moving forward. It has truly been a, a joy to see the work done across the kingdom. We duly appreciate the loan of your services. Thank you so much. I'm happy to give an oath.
When I was grown, I kneeled before my sovereigns and all my kinsmen and unto them give my troth. My heart is bold to the best I shall endeavor to defend this dream forever that has brought me to my oath. I, Alberic von Rostock. And I, Magnus Stendhal. Hear the lovely words and know them to be true and honorable. With faith, we know that this kingdom is a more welcoming place with you in it and grows with your service. And for our part, you have a place at our hearth and our protection in times of peace and war. You are a treasure. Until the crowns pass from our heads or the world ends, so say I, Alberic. And I, Tyndall. Consuls East. And, thank you, Your Majesties. And the words from your scroll. Here comes the East with banners raised. Join your voices, sing her praise. Shout to the sky in proud displays, Annalita the Pelican. <laughs> Look to the throne, the eastern light. Tyndall and Albrecht, their peers, invite. With their decree, our hearts ignite. Annalita, the pelican. <laughs> Look to our kin at call of need. Eastern help appears with speed. Whether tis to sing or feed. Annalita, the pelican. <laughs> Look to our webs, discussions loud. Moderate them while time allowed. As we come to fill the cloud, Annalita, the pelican. <laughs> Look to the pelicans of the eastern lands, sustain our kingdom by their hands. This is why she strongly stands, Annalita, the pelican. Scroll by Thura Eric Joseph. <laughs> For Annalita, newest companion to the order of the pelicans. Viva! 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 <laughs> I love it. <laughs> uh, thank you to everyone who showed up today and who's making this possible. Um, we really appreciate it because as much as we would love to have been there in person, um, timing and having three elevations in one day was kind of not in the cards. So yeah. it, it's just great that everyone was able to get together to be able to do this. So thank you so much and congratulations. Thank you very much. I think we're kind of there already. The banners behind them were made by the ladies of the yeah. <laughs> That's right. we, we did, we made those things. <laughs> it's, a tightly, it's a tightly woven little kingdom. Yes, it is. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much, everyone, your majesties. <laughs> Yeah, it was, it's fantastic to be in the right place at the right time to recognize someone so deserving. I look very much forward to when I get to see you both again in person. Absolutely. Indeed. Oh, no. right. I get to, do I get to greet my order? You get to greet your order? Yes. Oh, oh, oh please. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, we already know. We already know. <laughs> oh, no, I understand. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Here comes the east with banners raised. Join your voices, sing her praise. Shout to the sky. Oh, yeah.